Yeah, it's a warm up. An early, early warm up. Versus my my Negan. One, two. All right. Match three. That's this match, right? Tama, tama. That's this match. Of course, the Wing Chun Master is now a cyborg, and they go to wall standing too from Raiden. It is all or nothing. So this is Juker versus Raiden. Equal first to five. And then tentative matches. That's match four. Match five. Virgil versus Centress. Chepler versus Double Jakey. And then let me put in walk in. Walk in players. Walk in. Players. Fake. Two. Mundi. It's triple I, right? Yeah. And Bitmagin. Was it Bitmagin or is it Crucifer? Ah, oh, I forget. It's like two IGNs. I haven't finalized which IGN he's gonna be using fully for the cheese dojang data. One, one, two. Oh no, launch there. That could have been it for Juker. There you go, the jet upper. Oh, spending it with the rage drive. Mm -hmm. There you go, Raiden got away with that one. Again, punishment can anchor you. 915 to 184. There you go, big hell sweep. However, a little bit too far. Still gets the up forward four on that one. I'll, I'll use the Crucifer. Crucifer 17. Crucifer X 17. Yeah, I think that's what I remember. And then tentative matches. In quotations, not final. Oh, so it is bit magic. Okay, okay, okay. I think I'll just keep running with that IGN. Now. Thank you, Chester. Much thanks. I was like in my head, was that the actual one? That's what I remember. Because it has to use two IGNs. Enter. Did this pin comment update? Yes, it did. Yeah, so the walk-in players may potentially have a match. We'll see. Again, time check it is 9.50 in the evening, Philippine time. Bat versus Bat. We'll see if that'll happen. Here you go up four, denying the mid option of Juger. There are some evasive options like that that just say no to your mids. That's 1 0. Again, 1 0 in favor of Raiden with the Devil Jin. Devil Jin versus Brian. DFNT, Raiden. The micro stutters. Were there micro stutters? It didn't seem like there were. But the 3 plus 4 says no more, more to those stutters. Alvin cheering on Juker. The connection's a bit iffy, but weren't you five bars? Why? <laughs> For as long as we can communicate, it doesn't really matter whether you're speaking in Filipino or English. For as long as we can get the matches in and try to make sure the connection's as smooth as possible, that's all that matters. Jackbox. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> there are micro stuff is okay, but otherwise it's pretty smooth. KO. Round three. Fight. I looking for a taunt jet upper for to just wake up and get that execution locked and loaded, but so so far, looks like the adjustments have been in there. Early lead with a 2-0 in round, not in set. 2-0. Here you go, back forward two. With the evil intent. Or the laser scraper. Great whiff punish there. However, no follow-up. Not needing it though. Stepping to avoid that one. There you go. Answers back the first game with a no-round brown. Negan one stage. The Thabo loves that kind of cheese. Fight. Hockey charge lung. <laughs> I got the coke buff now. But right now I hope. You gotta put in the work. It's gonna be a combination of skill and luck. There you go. Juker with that early positioning. But one hell sweep is gonna change that all around. He's powering through it indeed. FF2 powering up with the drink. QCB24. No QCB4, but no need. One orbital heal. Ryan Fury again a cyborg. Seeing the future. Downloading the data ahead of time, but one counter hit on that DF2. All the Mishimas have a counter hit DF2 launcher. No punish on CD1. 
Of course, the electric version is still unsafe. So even if you make it just frame electric, right, on point, it's not going to make it safe like the electric wind god fist, which is negative 10, the wind god fist. DF2-1 keeping it at the wall. Back 3, 1 plus 2. Another early 2-0 lead for Juker. There you go, he's very much awake, the Wing Chun Master. Can Can, not connecting there in Juker. Getting the whiff punish and the low parry. DF2-1 overshoots it. Regular throw, no break, as a, either a 1 or a 2. They are not swapping sides. F4-1, the second hit. Juker has the Mr. Brownie sauce right now, the secret sauce, making being able to make the second hit the third hits of moves connect. Looking for that taunt jet upper. Alas, not there. Getting the back and now getting that taunt jet upper. Second try is the charm for Juker. 2-1. Juker's Brian almost there to the 1k club that Raiden's Claudio is part of. The true Tekken god right over here. Spacing it out. Oh, again, Juker does have that secret sauce. Great break on the generic throw this time. Ooh! Three plus four. Did wasn't able to catch down back three. That's interesting. Power crush, however, no punishment again from Duker. We'll see if that'll be into Raiden's advantage later in down into the set. This again, punishment can anchor you. Side wall splat. Still keeps the wall and sneaks it down with a one three. One three, tama deba. Yeah, I think that's the input. One three. Magic four confirming it fully. Gets the wall carry on the F4, back 4 1. No punish on the down 1 plus 2. Mm hmm. A little bit different from Raiden now. Able to prevent Juker's approach in neutral to turn it into offense. Raiden has been getting a lot of the initiative and pace here. Another down 4, that's two rounds, won by a low. Pushing it to around 3. Gonna answer back the no-round browns with a no-round bound of his own. We'll see. DF3 check. Here you go, more mid-checks. Now Juker wanting to get in and capitalizing it as much as possible. Looking for another taunt jet upper. Down back three. Ooh, running two. He's gonna get the starburst. Wall splat on point. I'm not sure if that's the most best combo you can get there. However, damage is still damage. Rage Art did he press a button? He did not. Oh, looking for a taunt jet upper. And not going for a full punish. He's gonna give Raiden the no round brown. Raiden on the first side. Here you go, default outfit as... Negan is one of those characters that you may need to use a mod to get, you know, drip. Because of his regular custom options in Tekken 7 are not that... They're, they're very sparse. Mm -hmm. Going for Intimidation 3. And there you go, the power card. That is the Negan backlash. Intimidation 1 plus 2. 4 3, the second hit of that is homing. Beautiful punish on the wall standing 2. Opting to go for those plus frames. Here you go, Raiden, knowing his cheese. Does not opt for wall carry, always looking for that starburst activation. Beautiful stuff on that on point on the F1 plus 2 for Juker. The Wing Chun Master has now learned how to use a bat. Oh, big counter hit with the up forward 2. That is the new move they added in Season 4 for Negan. Here you go, someone's playing Raft. <laughs> While standing 1-2, that is safe, and there you go, just throwing it out. If it goes in, it goes in. 10 seconds, an early Half-Life lead. Punish is a punish, however, that punish is gonna lead to guaranteed damage, here you go. Rage Drive in a Dream. They go denied with the DF1. No round brown again. Oh, their connection is... Okay. Either the connection is really fast, or their matches are going really fast. And I get to see them. It's like before I even get to change the names. They're already, it's already in-game. So again, the spectator data. Right? That means these rounds are going by pretty, pretty quickly. Looking for big launchers is Raiden and trying to keep that pace and that positional advantage. Back 1 plus 2, interrupting it. That was a little bit risky, but Juker so far not using any other moves to catch or lock with the back 1 plus 2. There you go, swapping outfits. I just noticed now. 
<laughs> one, two, one plus two. One, two, two. Not one plus one, two, one plus two. One, two, two. There you go, wall standing too. Great punish there from Juker. Back one plus two, slowing down on the floor. Oh, that could have been a wall standing one, four. Sidestep. Back one plus two, not FF2. Could flip over with FF2 after the count, after the four hits on counter hit. DF2. Looking for more launchers is Raiden to get all that damage. No duck. Here you go, Juker just patiently waiting for Raiden's attacks. Did he press a button in Intimidation? He did not. But you can block in Intimidation. It's one of those stances where you can block. Compared to Huang's Flamingo, you cannot block in Flamingo. Here you go, using the transition of DF2 to Intimidation. Int 4 to Int 1 plus 2. Gets the wall splat on point, goes for the up 4 2, looking for that Okizeme. And that's hit confirmable. The intimida Intimidation 1 2 for 7 slices of perfect cheese. 1 6 1 to 1 8 5. Up forward 2. Here you go, setting it up just like Quarang RFS F2 2 backlash. Negan channeling his inner Quarang right there. More Intimidation 1 plus 2s. It's launcher galore. Up 4. 1, 2, 2, locking him in, and there you go, tying it all, 3 all apiece. So we'll see how Juker will create his Okizeme now. There you go, back 1 plus 2, off of running 2, and just walking up to the down back 2 with that new Intimidation low, which is very, very strong, Intimidation down 2. Non-stop, there you go, another pack of perfect cheese for juker just adding it to the putting it in the refrigerator here you go more perfect cheese <laughs> not cool on point is juker with that read going for the guaranteed damage once more 48 seconds have passed or on the clock rather 20 seconds there you go that's more accurate has passed jab galore fast move after fast move denying Raiden, any frame of vantage of any sort. Back 4 2. Still has Starburst. No walk there. And that's going to be an unblockable damage for Raiden. DF2. Does not fully confirm the 4 3 is a punish. And that's going to pay the price for that one. Juker with the F3 2. 2. Going high. That is homing. Plus frames. Here you go. Fast move after fast move again. It's like whoever has the pace. And Raiden is fighting to keep that pace. Back four goes for the rage drive. Down two. Great break. Goes, oh, nah, not again. There you go. Juker has been able to squeeze that in, every, in in between a lot of Raiden's attacks, or even without any attack. F1 plus two. The story of this match, including Intimidation 1 plus two. And speed, there you go. Good punish on the back 3 3. Half life lead already for Juker. What does Raiden left have left in the bag? There you go, waiting for that. Gets the down 2 2, no block there. On the second hit, Raiden has a chance to make it. Great punish on the kip up on the 3 plus 4. Final, final cheese. We'll see if Raiden can stay alive. Will Juker change his plan, his plan of attack? Instead of waiting, will he go in? Manuel loves that kind of cheese. Spacing it out, misses that whiff punish, however, that still does count as a punish. And that is a legitimate punish over there. Hop kick, denied the down back two. F2, alright, gets another set to work with. More plus frames upon plus frames. Looking for the Sky Blade Nova. Mm-hmm. And there you go, sneaking in, in with the low to make it 4-3. Raiden staying really fast, huh? Round one. So we'll see what kind of action they cooked up. Bringing back the Brian Fury, the one who started it all. Versus the Claudio. I'm gonna get him. <laughs> I'm gonna make him play tonight. On a Sunday night, as Monday looms over. No punish on that, however, maximizing the frames to get the down 2-2. Right at the wall, almost there for the wall damage. Jumping back with the up, full, up back one, and there you go, one, two for two slices of KO cheese. Round two. It is all or nothing. DF2, that is similar to Lars's old DF2, however, that DF2 for Claudio, I believe, is unsafe. Back three, here you go. Pushing towards the wall, looking for another taunt, maybe. Back four into the upper. Back three to the double knees, there you go. 
And seven slices of perfect cheese for Juger. Only took around 15 seconds. But these rounds are going fast. There you go, good block on the second hit. And there you go, beautiful duck on the 4 3. That does not jail, ladies and gentlemen. It does not. Looking for a taunt again. Here you go, the Northern Cross. Unfortunate trade for Raiden. Lady Luck shining upon Juker. Here you go, running too. Raiden wanting to get it back. All that damage. Here you go. I said here you go too many times. <laughs> Yes, there are four characters in this set. Four? Five characters. That's Claudio, Devil Jin, Jin, Brian, and Negan. Five characters in total from this set. Here you go, multiple taunts. Bounding with the back three. Here you go, shoulder. If he pressed any, any button there. No break on the generic throw. DF2-1. Keeping him locked in. Launch punishable. Misses out. However, overshoots it. Three plus four. Good break. Raiden, a dream with no rage. Let's see what he can make happen, but no, the Skyblade, no, the whiffs, and Juker takes it over Raiden. Good games to both players. Good games. God. One of the two. Okay. Okay. Oh, -ho. I didn't do anything. Oh, not you too, man. <laughs> That's how you play Warang. That's how you play Warren. Guaranteed, it works.